custom curves. Uh, just a, just another short video. Basically, I'm going to show you today uh, about using a, the, the proper torque settings, torque wrench settings, uh, when you're when you're doing the the, the head nuts or studs, stud nuts uh, on the Kawasaki curve, specifically for the curve, uh, because if these aren't tensioned properly, what happens is that the oil won't go to the head. And um, sadly, a lot of times with curves, they do run out of oil, um, obviously overheating and then damaging things like your cams and your rocker arms, etc. So it's super, super important to get the right tension uh, on the nuts here. Um, and what we're going to be using is our trusty torque wrench. Okay, The setting for these is actually 22 newton meters. Uh, I don't know what that is in foot pound, but 22 newton meters. So basically, um, what we start off as, we don't go straight to 22. What we do is, like a mine here, it's got 20 and I go down till I've got the 6 there, which will make it 16 newton meters. So I go to 16 first, and then 18, 20, and then 22. Now when I'm doing these, um, I don't go around like that. Basically, if I'm going to start on this one, I do diagonal, just to, to even out the, the pressure. The talk. So from here I will go to here, then to here, then to here, and then back again, doing it that way. Okay? So again, here we are. Uh, I'm set at 16. First, we'll start up here. There, it clicked. Okay? We'll come down to this one. Yeah, this one's already a little loose, so. Yeah. Okay, so now that's at 16, so then we'll set it to 18. Okay, same sequence again, starting at the top here. Here, cross, okay, so that was 18, then we unlock it and go to 20, and up here, wait for the click, click, Okay, that's a 20. Now, we've got to go to 22. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a 22. And then we go up here. And the important thing is to wait for the click. There you go, just to double check. There you have it. Um, again, super useful tool. Unfortunately, not enough people here in the Philippines use them. Okay, but um, I do always. It really makes a difference, especially on these curve engines where if you over tighten these or if, if it's not tightened properly, the oil doesn't want to come up to the top. So super, super important. So there you go. Just another little tip from me, Danny, Custom Curves. Um, if you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel. You'll find a link up there.